99% of you have never seen this map before, but I guarantee everyone who played Titanfall 1 will recognise the map later on in the video. Welcome everyone, today I'm showcasing some things few people have actually seen, and firstly, none of this would be possible without the help of Catonot and Bob the Bob for showing me these maps, and another modder called Biscuit for their expertise in getting the maps running and working on Titanfall 2. So thank you to all of you, it's a pleasure to be able to show even more modding potential for Titanfall 2. This map is simply called MP underscore box. And let me tell you a tiny bit about its history. MP box is a Titanfall 1 developer map, probably used to test out various things, and these modders have managed to port it into Titanfall 2. The map is pretty basic, not exactly incredible on the eye, but still pretty fun to play on seeing as I've literally never played a different map for 5 years. And whilst the map might not look the best, the background definitely makes up for it. This map symbolises something important. It shows the potential of ported Titanfall 1 maps into Titanfall 2. And this will become more apparent with the next map I show, but this demonstrates that it's possible to have Titanfall 1 maps used in Titanfall 2. So once I'd have some good fun on MP Box, Bob reached out to me and asked whether I'd actually like to play on a map that I would recognise, Runoff. And before we dive into this map, first, join the Discord and like the video, obviously. And second, you must remember that this is still a work in progress. MP Box is just the beginning, so Titanfall 1 maps probably won't be on Titanfall 2 Northstar soon, but they're definitely not a possibility to be ruled out in a few months time. So let's jump into Runoff. I'm going to stop right here because I know you have some burning questions that I'll answer. Why is the floor purple and black? Well, it's meant to be water, but the source engine water system just crashes the game. So Bob has just removed it for now, so it just appears as purple and black. And second, you ask, why is there an error text where it's meant to be walls and things like that? And this is just simply where models aren't in the game yet. As I said, it's probably a thought for a few months in the future, yet it still shows even more potential for the modding scene in Titanfall 2, and I'm excited for the future of Northstar modding. Let me know what you think of this, and if any other modders would like their amazing creations showcased, please DM me on Discord. I'm sure everyone would love to see more cool stuff for this amazing, amazing game. Thank you all for watching, and have a good day.